Hey Ubers, it's Anna. I finished a paper bag card and I would like to share it with you. It's my very first paper bag card, so be nice. Is it so cute? Okay, so this is a My Favorite Things flourish. This is a paper clip that I have um, altered and I um, backed it with the Prima lyric line. And if you look up close, here's a little tiny butterfly. And then I put a jump ring and a pink pearl to match the lyric paper line. And the paper collection that I used for the paper bag card is the Primrose by DCWB. Here is some yellow and white baker's twine that I was gifted by Marilu from Tiger Bunny Creations. Here's a made with love charm that I got from Joanne Fabrics. Here is some white lace that I got from the paper bag lady one on Zibit. Here's some silver bling for my stash. I curled the paper and underneath is a doily. Um, here's some fabric flowers. Here's a wood veneer. Um, I glimmer misted it. You probably won't be able to tell. But yep, I glimmer misted it and there is a little flat back rhinestone in the center of the flower for the center. Okay, and then you take this off. And I didn't do anything to the side, I just left it playing to the clothespin. And on the back here is the lyric paper. And all I did is I put a hole in there. And I just put a little um, jump ring. And put a little pearl with an eye with a head pin. Okay. So that just holds the shop. And then you open it. Here I matted it with some cream card stock. Here's more of that TCWP promo stack. Um, this I just put, it's a little piece of leftover lace. I just more patched on there. Here's another little tiny butterfly punch. Um, this paper is from my stash and I packed it on one of those wood veneers that I got from Joanne or from, yeah, from Joanne's. Here is a cutout from the primrose stack and I matted it with cream cardstock. And I put a little butterfly on top. And Glenn Rums did this like crazy also, but of course you probably won't be able to see the shot. Okay, and then you stick that back in there, and then, uh, let's see, here's the other side, here is a flat back that I got, that I got gifted from Anna, from a Fias 72 
and then here is another cutout and I matted it with some more cream cardstock and there's another one of my um, just leftover pieces of lace that I mop hodged on there and then all of the papers are edged or not etched but they're um, all I went around all the edges of the paper with um, let's see I think it's French vanilla from Apple Barrel and then here is a sticker that I was gifted from Malou from Tiger Bunny Creations. Here's the Martha Stewart die, and I um, glued that as a pocket, made that as a pocket. Then you open it up. And you take it out like that, and then the inside, I matted it with some more of that cream cardstock and primrose stack. And then here is just another piece of my um, leftover lace that I'm all pushed on there. Um, I tied this up with some string, here's a little bead cap, I went around the edges, distressed all the edges, and I went around all the edges with Yep, it's by Apple Barrel, it is vanilla and then you stick that back in there and what you do is you actually stick that in the um, front flap of the paper bag Okay, and you just stick that right in there. And then I didn't do anything to the back, but I did on this to do it also. And there you go. So, I just wanted to try this out because um, I had noticed on YouTube that everybody had been making some and they look kind of fun to make and I just kind of watched a video and took off one off on my own so there you go I hope everybody likes it and I hope everybody's having a wonderful day and I will see everybody in my next video bye